Serena, girl, that's not it. No, you're with the alien guy. And Gabriel is trying to glue his pieces back together. Gabriel still feels sad about his divorce with Serena. He's feeling a bit lost now that he lost her. Okay, Rose is inviting Oliver to go to her house. When he arrived there, he got a text from this girl, Lamau. They decided to swim together. Oh boy, he got a crush on Rose. What a surprise. They got out from the pool to flirt. I thought they were flirting innocently. That's not gonna happen. Just go home, Oliver. Even when he's sleeping, he's sad. Gabriel is going through it, smoking while on the toilet. He doesn't want to take down the pics of him and Serena. Maybe he's waiting on a miracle. Gabriel is very depressed at this point. He doesn't feel joy anymore. Oliver's friend came for a visit and now they're playing together. Another friend came by, but Gabriel said he needs to talk to him in private. Gabriel told him he decided to move out from Oasis Springs. There's nothing holding him here. Oliver is a bit upset because he's dating Rose. Gabriel said he could stay with his mother if that's what he wants. Oliver needs time to decide it. Gabriel said he has only a day to think about it. Rose came to visit Oliver until he decides what he's going to do. He won't tell her. He's going to enjoy the time he has with her. He also bought her chocolate. Sharp oh. moosh. Oh. Yes and no. Mm. <laughs> you had a vote? Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Mm. oh so cool. <laughs> Rose decides to stay for the night, of course without her parents unaware where she is. While she was asleep, Oliver was watching her and thinking about what he's going to do. Should he stay because of her or to go with his dad that Cleary can't be left alone right now? If he goes, will she be mad at him? Maybe they could find each other again later. It's hard to make a choice when something will turn your life upside down. Gabriel is trying to clean the house to sell it. Serena, what are you doing here? Did you come here to rub his wounds? Gabriel is like, what are you doing to me, watcher? And she brought him a gift. She gave him a pizza. So I imagine she came here to talk about him leaving. It hurts to watch these two. I imagine that Oliver texted her telling that he might move with his father and she came to talk about it. He said if Oliver goes with him, it's his choice, he's not pressuring him. But Serena doesn't want him to go and Gabriel said she should talk to Oliver, not him. Serena feels like she's losing all of her children. Gabriel made a sarcastic comment on how this is funny since he thinks she doesn't care about having children. 
Serena, girl, that's not it. No, you're with the alien guy. And Gabriel is trying to glue his pieces back together. This is so hard for him. He still loves her, but at the same time, he's mad. And apparently, he needs to go to the doctor. He has a chronic condition now. Gabriel gave Oliver a bit more time to think. His life is going to change after all. Gabriel quit his job. It's not like his career was working for him. Since Oliver was born, he had to step back to stay more at home with the kids. And also because he felt like he owed Serena that, since she was alone when she had the baby, it was their first fight. Gabriel realized that it all started to go down the drain because of his career. Everything about that house reminds him of something he doesn't want to remember. His dead mother, his dead cat, his ex-wife, his runaway teen. All his fails, he needs to change his life. When Oliver arrived from school, he saw his dad smoking alone. He came to the realization that it's better for Gabriel to not be alone. Oliver told Gabriel he's going to move out with him and Gabriel is happy. Oliver just needs to break up with Rose first. She took it better than he was expecting. He asked her if she wanted to watch a movie one last time and she said yes. Avery, what are you doing here, my dude? He's so pretty. The movie ended and Oliver was doing push-ups in the middle of the street. It's funny that he had a death wish thing in front of the alien billboard Lamau. Maybe he blames his parents' divorce on the alien guy. Oh my god, so many ghosts wandering after life and death pack. After a few weeks that they moved out, Aspen is finally here for a visit. She now is in touch with her parents. Gabriel is happy to see her again. Gabriel is now a fisherman living in Brindleton Bay. Oliver is trying to fit in in this new place. They're going to have a meal together. Everyone saw that, Gabe. Don't pretend nothing happened. Yeah.